about your destination and also packing your materials appropriately. Hmm, I want to hike, but where I will go? Let me search. Oh my god, it's just close to the Kupan boundary to Mangaldan. Okay, but first, I need to change my clothes. Ta-da! First, we need your camp bag and your tent where you will sleep. You need also canned goods and a biscuits. And don't forget your water. And to protect your skin, you need sunblock and a lotion. And don't forget your alcohol. And the most very important is your hiking kit. This is very important, don't forget it, for in case of emergencies and so forth. Let's pack it all and put it in the camp bag. Ready? And let's go! Travel and camp on durable surfaces. When exploring your surroundings or setting up your picnic and overnight camps, seek out the resilient types of terrain. Durability refers to the ability of surfaces or vegetation to withstand wear or remain in a stable condition. Durable surfaces such as rock, sand, and gravel, trails, or grasses. Here are some general tips. Concentrate use on existing trails and campsites. Walk single file in the middle of the trail, even when wet or muddy. Keep campsites small. Focus activity in areas where vegetation is absent. Sites are found, not made. Altering a site is not necessary. Protect riparian areas by camping at least 200 feet from lakes and streams. Setting up a tent. Your tent is now ready. Dispose of waste properly. Dispose of waste properly. The center and carriers alter enthusiasts to consider the impact that they leave behind which will undoubtedly affect other people, water, and wildlife. Do not litter. Minimize Campfire Impact Campfire building is an important skill for every camper. Camp stoves has encouraged a shift away from the traditional fire for cooking. Stoves has become essential equipment for minimum impact camping. They are fast, flexible and eliminate firewood availability as a concern in campsite selection. Camp stoves operate in almost any weather condition and leave no trace. Take only pictures, leave only footprints. Don't touch or take things, kill nothing but time. Respect wildlife. Do not feed them. Observe wildlife from distance. Do not follow them or approach them. You can use camera if you encountered some animals and zoom it in. Be considerate with other visitors. Go there, Anna. Go there. 
one of the most important components of outdoor ethics to the courteous toward other visitors. It helps all visitors enjoy their outdoor experience. Many people come to the outdoors to listen to nature. Treat them the way you want to be treated. These are the seven principles of Live No Trace. So visit and come with your family and friends. For sure, you will enjoy and may you feel excitement and safeness. Enjoy!